Okay, finally, finally, finally getting around to uploading the videos that I took when I went up to visit um, Brimfield Flea Market and Antiques, as well as visiting with Helen Booty and Steph Sell Stuff by the Seashore. It's probably going to be choppy because I don't know much about editing videos, but I'm just going to put them all out there and you can take a look and let me know what you think. Talk to you later. Sit back, relax, because it is so much to see. Good morning. I'm in beautiful Missick, Connecticut. This is my second day. I arrived yesterday at um, in Providence, Rhode Island, and Helen, the New England I thrifter, she picked me up at the airport, but came in to greet me at the luggage was Stephanie from... Steph sells stuff by the seashore. And Helen booked us this beautiful um, Airbnb. And I'm going to turn it around and give you kind of an overview of it. But look at the. I am a. Guess I don't know how to turn my camera around. So I guess I'm going to have to do it like. Look how beautiful the grass is. I love, love, love beautiful green grass. But here is the little cottage like we're staying in. And it is so beautiful on the inside. So I'm gonna go in and show you that. I'll be right back at the inside. Hey, I'm back. I'm still outside, but it's just so beautiful. It's warm here this morning. I think it's supposed to get in the 70s. So I'm gonna go in the house now. Ugh, beautiful. Okay. This is the living area. Look how gorgeous. And if you've seen our video the other night, we went through some jewelry jars last night. Roy from Dust Not Included and Gina Marie came by. We had a lovely dinner yesterday. And this is the little living room. And then look at the kitchen. This is the little eat-in kitchen area, but it has a beautiful granite countertop, seating for four at the counter. And even though it's teeny, it is so nice and spacious feeling. And I hadn't been out this door. Let's see what's out this door here. Let's see here, what's out here. Oh, it's just a side entrance. Little coat rack. Okay, so that's what's out there. I hadn't been out there, so I didn't know. It's kind of a beach theme, and this is the teeniest bathroom you ever seen, but it has so much space in it. I mean, you know, it's got everything you need. Look how teeny tiny that sink is. I'm going to put my hand in just to give you a comparison. So you can see it's only about that wide, but it has a nice walk-in shower, beautiful tile work. And then, so that's the bathroom. And I like the doors they chose, too. They're nice doors. Then we're going to walk back in. It has three bedrooms, but of course, I'm only going to show you one bedroom. There's Helen this morning. She's up early, huh? I'm an early bird. I am, too. I've been up for hours. Oh, well, I woke up, and then I went back to sleep. I'm filming. Hi. Good morning. Hi. Isn't she beautiful? This is early in the morning, y'all. Look how beautiful. Yeah, no. I'm wearing the same shirt because... You don't have to tell us that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a cute shirt. TMI. Too much information, but it's a nice bathroom, very nice hardwood floor. Sure, yeah, yeah, I showed them that other bathroom, how cute I it did was. Good. Yeah, she, she did do very good. And that's a bedroom there. Very nice decor all throughout. Then there's two little steps that come up. And Steph is from the West Coast, so of course she's still sleeping. I'm going to wake her up. <laughs> she said she's going to wake her up. And this is the bedroom they gave me. I feel like such a guy. I feel so honored, y'all. I love the pictures. But look at that nice dresser. Oh, I should have made the bed up before I brought y'all in. Beautiful sunlight comes in. But this is the bed. And I was laying in the bed crochet and finishing a little hat that I started yesterday. But I'm going to spread this bed up a little bit. They had everything so beautiful. I mean, it was just so nice when I got here yesterday. And the weather is supposed to be beautiful. And today we're going to some, can you guess where? Thrift stores. 
And one is supposed to be like, oh, I can't wait. Steph said it's one of the best she's ever been to. Look at my suitcase. I decided I wanted to update it a little bit. It's one of those old black suitcases. But I just love all the soft colors and everything. And I'll show you what I was laying in the bed working on. I made that little Barbie hat. And today I'm going to crochet a little purse to go to it, I think. So that's what I've been working on, using this cotton thread and this teeny, tiny, tiny crochet hook. You barely can see the hook part. So I'm hoping I can, like, put all these videos together of some of the things we did yesterday. We went to a place called Johnny Cakes yesterday. I really didn't find a ton of stuff. Well, I'm kind of on restriction still, y'all. Uh, but I will show you one thing I got. We went to another place over in um, Rhode Island. It's like right across the street. One street's Rhode Island. The other one is Connecticut. But queen of unfinished projects. That is me. So I'm going to put that someplace. And then I did get a little book. Hold on. I'll show you the book. I did get two little golden books, too, that I did not have. But I thought that would be interesting. Some pack, patchwork quilts, um, gifts and stuff, 20 uh, projects. So we'll see what I actually do in there. Here's some of the projects. So that's the first little part of my vlog or whatever you want to call it for today. And I will come back later. Talk to you. Bye-bye. Car, it's making a funny noise. Mm. So between Steph and I, we're gonna figure this thing out. Let's see here. The rotor <laughs> and the pad. They are very rusty looking, really aren't rusty. they? They're scrubbing. Yeah. Because it should not look like that. See that shiny yeah. part? It shouldn't be that. Yep. Yep. He needs tires probably worse than hell and then. Yeah, I'm surprised that Yeah, y'all, we know what we're doing. We're going to become mechanics. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they're supposed to look like that. Maybe they are. No. Well, they are very rusted. Well, they're rusty, but see, not only are they rusty, see all that wear in there? Yeah. Because, like, look at oh, this part. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see, they're not grinding in there, and that's what's probably making that noise when we stop. All right. So, once it start doing that, then you can't just get the pads. You have to get the rotors and everything yeah. or whatever replaced. This, oh, we don't want to show his tag number. Maybe they mixed the cars up. I mean... This is the one that seemed like it needed to go get the brake. It's your fault, Helen Booty! <laughs> Steph, show them what you have. We're at Broomsfield, y'all. Look at there. This was like our very first start, y'all, and I've already picked up stuff, but I got a great deal on it. I'll show you just a peep. We bought these bags right here, y'all, at the, um, at Goodwill. And they have little handles and Helen found a really nice black and white one as well. I don't know where it is, but Helen is over there. <laughs> and look at these lamps. I know, I like that one. Yeah, both of those are really nice. Okay, so. Helen, where's your pool cart? It's over there. Oh, I see it. Ooh, a sewing box. I love these big sewing boxes, too. But I got a couple of those I haven't did anything with. Um, John, come here. These sell well, uh, too. Do this oh, do they? Yeah, these shell photos, yeah. Ooh, a big box. Lots of really nice glass. This is hysterical. Okay, I have three things. This is what I found, these little things here. Okay, uh, did you do 10 on those? How about five? All right, sure. Okay, thank you. 
Okay. I'm going to sleeve all of these vintage children's clothes. You know how I absolutely love them. This is just a start. And then look. Can you believe how much? I mean, it's boys, it's girls, it's suitcases, it's shoes on the ground, it's boots, it's a few toys. So I'm getting ready to dig in and look, but y'all know I like absolutely love all the little vintage clothing. I'll just have to get at least one just to say that I got one. Maybe, you know, because... I've already gotten so much stuff. Love that one too. But these are small, so they can kind of fold up flat in my suitcase. Oh, believe it or not, I have this one here. Oh, I love, you know, I love smocking too. Look at the smocking on that one. So let's walk over here a little bit. I'm gonna walk slow and hope I'm not making you too dizzy. But y'all know, I just like love, love, love children's vintage clothes. I wore these when I was a little girl, these little rompers here. Hey, how are you doing? Hey, I absolutely love children's clothes. Ooh, this is a different one here. How much is this little outfit? That's 22. 22. Look at this one, y'all. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, I love it. Yeah. <laughs> I've never seen any of these vintage like this yeah, one. Yeah, it's pretty rare. I've never seen something like that. Yeah, that's a very it's different one. It's crest. crest. Crest? Like this is like, it's polyester press. It's a really like Oh, yeah, yeah, I, I have. So this is probably from like the 40s? That's actually 60s. 60s, okay, because I have some from the 40s with some fabric almost like this, but Maybe it's real fake right, looking. Maybe actually you're right, but I feel like Looking 40s at the label. Is, but the, the problem is that... Um, yeah, I would say it's 60s. Oh, it's right. Yes, Brian, because you so don't definitely. Have, um machine work before World War II. For, yeah. Like yeah, it's all yeah. When I looked at the label too, and I they don't knew. Have synthetics. Yeah. Hello. Look how she's done this one, y'all. Like a 12 or 14? Cuz I have stuff in your set. Look at this little one. You know, I like that style. But I need to concentrate y'all on some bigger stuff. Excuse me for moving the camera so fast. Yeah. Okay, let's walk around. We hadn't been inside of the booth yet, so let's go in. Yeah, I get the teeny tinies and hats and stuff and dress dolls with too. Ooh, look at this one, y'all. Says, love me. That's a teeny one. That would be nice for a doll. Do you do bikinis? Hmm? Do you do dolls? Yes. Yeah, I make dolls as well as get vintage dolls and antique dolls and redress them, redo them. My daughter, she was born in 83. She had these in pink and it had a matching sweater. And I had them on, YouTube, on um, Etsy. And I got a strike violation because it said, uh, I, you know, they don't allow stuff with drawstring. It's been, I've been selling drawstring stuff on there for a while. It was a sweater, yeah. You I see don't sell it, I bought this one. Oh, you don't? Are you local? No, I'm in Connecticut. Connecticut, okay. They just sell on stories on Instagram. Oh, okay, so she sells on Instagram, y'all, so y'all can always go and follow her. I only sell in May. I do one sale in May and one sale in September because I'm a lot of ambassador. So. Oh, okay. So May and September she sells. So be watching for the sales or follow her. And I'm quite sure you'll be able to see when she have a sale. Yeah, we just got here. So I'm trying not to. I'm trying to look before I start. Is Steph still over there talking? No, she's over there. Oh, okay. So we, I'll definitely be. I was telling her I had those in pink. Oh, this is cute. How much is this uh, little that one? That one's sold. That's it's like sold. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we will definitely be back. I love it. Holla! Makes you want to holla! <laughs> <laughs> She's digging in the dollar bin. <laughs> so excited! 
Look, look, y'all, look. Upcoming sale. Let me hold up the right way. Let there me. you go. Thank you. All right. That's good. Okay, y'all. Wait till you see all of these here. Do you know who that is? Two Dog Dick showed these on their channel. Can you believe this many? Wow, 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 wow. I have never seen this many in one place. Are you live? Wow, yeah. Uh, we were live Tuesday. You see how many people were here? Yeah. Um, this paper. Any questions for you on anything? Yeah, what is what type of the um I've never the what? These here. What what are I those? think that's probably about three or four hundred dollars. I know, I wasn't asking about the price it's, I know. Oh it's um Venetian. Venetian glass. Oh okay, that is beautiful. This is Steph's first time at Walmart, y'all. <laughs> oh, look at him, yay! He popped yeah. up, yeah. He's all the way up. Sitting right there. That's his little home. Whatever. Yep, he's eating that little. This that is, is exciting, y'all. We were at the restaurant, and this is our current view. <laughs> look at the, the beautiful. Oh, look at so cute. He is cute. Go back over, give you one last look at the beach. Oh, look at oh, there he goes. Whoop. It is this. It's kind of freaking me out a little bit. It's kind of like a wet rodent. It is.